Today I want to talk to you about how to brake correctly while cycling. Now if you're new to cycling or you're an intermediate and you haven't been on your bike very much, uh, first order of business is to figure out is your left brake go to the front tire or does your right brake go to the front of the tire. If you don't know that, walk over to your bike right now, put this on pause and go figure that out because that's extremely important. If you do know what that is and your left brake goes to the front of the tire as mine happens to, then most coaches will tell you that in normal situations you need to apply 75% of your braking power to the front tire and 25% to the back tire. Now if you don't understand momentum, basically what's happening is you're applying 75% of that braking power to the wheel that's in front of you, so you're actually slowing yourself down. If you apply it to the back wheel, you're already past that tire and you're actually adding weight to that. So if you haven't done the 75%, 25% braking technique, I want you to give it a try. It works in most instances. Obviously, if you're going down a hill or you're in icing conditions or there's a lot of traffic and you need to adjust accordingly, then please do that. But for the majority of your cycling or biking, you need to be applying the 75%, 25% rule. Thanks for watching. Now don't forget to subscribe.